recognize that stripe. That looks yes, it nice. Is. It is. It that is. looks nice. It's like 90s. I love that about yes, Gucci. Yes, it is. Shout yes. out to Dapper Dan. Yes. Rick has songs about sunglasses. He has, you have your own sunglass collection, right? I do. I have, I collect my own. Yes, I do. Oh, I love it. I love it. Okay, so he's never seen without sunglasses, which I love. Basically, he's known for his sunglasses, y'all. So what's with the sunglasses? It could go back to me as a youngster. When I was a youngster in elementary school, a lot of my friends used to pick on me because of the length of my eyelashes. Wait, are they like really long? Uh, I, I think. I'm I think, like, I think sometimes. Oh my they're, gosh! They're not. Let me see. They're beautiful. Wow. See, this is what ticks me off about men. They are wasted. I have these short. I have these short, stubby little like, and then pregnancy ruined it even more. It's like. I don't understand. Afterward, lashes. These ain't nothing on me is mine. And like, <laughs> and those are just natural and you're hiding it. I'm upset with you, Rick Ross. And as a, as a youngster, I hated them. Oh, really? I did. They're I did. so beautiful. I did. But I do like the shades too. It's rock and roll. I, I'm into it. I'm into it. So I thought it, I thought it might be fun. Since you love some guys you're known for, I thought it might be fun to try on like a few iconic frames. See how they look on you. Are you cool with that? I'm with it. All right, all right. Come on out here, Elf. Yeah. He's like the most miserable elf. <laughs> it's, yeah. gr it's great, great. <laughs> he is killing that Christmas spirit. All right, all right. Let's ease into it, shall we? Okay, I think you're gonna go with these first. These, these are like, they kind of look like you too, like Bono, a little Bono-esque. So let's try these. Make some noise for okay. Bono. Exactly. Yeah. I love Bono. Let's see. Yeah! yeah. Yes, they do look good on you. Yeah. OK, OK. Well, this one, this is, uh, I think Oprah has been rocking a bold look like these these days. So, I mean, if it's good for Oprah, it's good for all of us, right? This is probably on her Make some noise for Oprah. Oprah. Good in sunglasses. You have like the perfect shape head. I'm not kidding. I look. <laughs> I have to. I have to go for a specific style, or it's like, nope. Um, okay, we're gonna go for these. Obviously, these are a little Elton John. Make some noise for Elton John. These are a little more Elton John. These are these are a little flashy. A little flashy. Yep. Which one is your favorite if you had to pick? Because I'm just saying the bedazzle is nice. <laughs> uh, I may go with these. Oh, you're going to the Oprah one. Yeah, I may go I with Oprah. You can't go wrong. You can't go wrong. You're going to rock those for the rest of the show? You don't have to. Yours are pretty cool, too. But let's, let's seriously, though, let's talk about your book. Because you have a memoir out. It's called Hur Hurricanes, right? Hurricanes, yes. Yeah, so what, what's it about? It's really just talking about my rise. Uh, you know, my rise to where I am today as mm -hmm. an artist, you know, just letting you know that we all love the, 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 the sun shining, but you will deal with hurricanes in life and just, you got to yeah. deal with them. You got to deal with them yeah. and move forward. You know, I'm coming in the album number 10. You have to uh, challenge yourself creative wise. Mm -hmm. And I wanted to bring something else to the game in a different perspective. So me telling everyone just my straight from me, my voice, and I felt it'll blow a lot of people's minds. Yeah. And I wanted it to come out with the album. The album went number one, so yeah. it's just a lot of dope passion. That's so awesome. I'm so happy for you. Thank you. And it's awesome, I think, too, for fans just to get, like, inside your heart and head. And that's why I like to be a songwriter. I like singing songs that I didn't write, but that's I also awesome. love to write, because it gives people the opportunity to kind of see who you are. All the so. time. All the yeah. time. So I actually heard that you were recently nominated for Grammy, right? I am. Yeah! <laughs> Grammy nominated yeah. for the record single Gold Roses featuring Drake, one time for Drake. Yeah, yeah. I love that. And for me, what makes this moment even that much more special is the record was actually conceived from a conversation me and Drake had yeah. over Nipsey Hussle. You know, uh, rest in peace to Nipsey Hussle. Um, it was a conversation that we had and we was just speaking about, you have to, a lot of times, let's celebrate a person's energy while they're still here to Accept it, you know, yeah. and that's what it was about. I love that too. Those end up being the greatest records, the greatest songs. Have you finished your holiday shopping? 
I haven't. I haven't. You I haven't. are you. The clock is ticking. No, the clock is ticking, and you know it, it's. It, it feels like you never finish when you have four little beautiful children. Oh, me too. I have four as well. It's like it's never. I still think I'm done, and then I'm like, wait, did I did I even it out? Because do no, they it, count? Do they know, count the gifts like they got more than me? And, and not only that, it, it's you know four in the morning. It's like Amazon is just knocking at your. Oh phone. my gosh. <laughs> but are you stressed about the holidays? Do you get stressed about it, both of you? I try not to. You don't get stressed? Do you get stressed? I'm totally stressed. I get stressed. I think the mamas get super stressed. We feel like we're the ones that people are going to look at and be like, it wasn't great. Uh, yeah. And yeah. we got to cook, too. Yeah. Most definitely. Oh, I'm a sous cook. chef. My sister does that. Yeah. Oh, My really? sister's like solid in a kitchen. I am solid at eating in a kitchen. Um, <laughs> yep. I am good at it. Of- I rock it. I will not stop talking until you subscribe to my YouTube channel. That's right, and I can talk a lot. Seriously, not gonna stop. Yep, still here, not going anywhere. I see you. Don't walk away from this.